Main sources were from the DMK speaking out saying that Raja's stand has been vindicated and that they have all along maintained that it was a matter of policy with no crime in it. Dhania Rajendran joining us with more. Dhania, shot in the arm basically for the DMK. Well, definitely, Deep, it is a shot in the arm for the DMK and the party, uh, all the sources that we are talking to, very categorically saying that they believe uh, that this revelation has come at the right time. Uh, DMK's Raja has been consistently saying that it was a matter of policy. So what the DMK says is that uh, this uh, finance ministry's note clearly proves that there was concurrence of the then finance minister, uh, Peach Dumbram. So this was indeed the UPA uh, policy decision. So why should Raja be the only one who is suffering? What the DMK says is that Raja was termed as an accused uh, in the entire case, was put behind bars. They also say that the same yardstick should now be applied uh, to UPA leaders. So, uh, of course, the DMK leaders quite happy with this entire revelation, not uh, coming out to say that, but off the record, all of them maintain the same thing, that this will be a shot in the arm, uh, and especially uh, when the case uh, comes in the court, once again, uh, when Kanimuri and Raja's lawyers will be, uh, of course, taking up their sides, this will come as a huge point for them. Uh, until now, all the lawyers representing A. Raja and Kanimuri have been continuously maintaining that there was no mm -hmm. crime, it was a policy matter only.